Hello traders, I just want to talk about New Zealand dollar because I think we uh, have a nice trade set up here. This is a daily chart on New Zealand dollar. And as you can see I've drawn these lines in here. Uh, previous resistance and previous support down the bottom here. So as you can see all price has been doing continuously for days and days. It's just bouncing between these two lines. And every time it got to the top I was selling it. I haven't been buying it. Always selling it because I believe the pair is going to go down. Here's why. We had this move down. This looks like a consolidation period. So I'm expecting price to break and head down again. And a lot of the time, what you'll notice with uh, currencies is you'll get the same move again. So what I mean by that is, is is this. So we have this. Let me draw it in for you. We have this move down like so then we consolidate for a while and we've made this high up here so I'll move this line like so and so I'd expect to see eventually price to come down to this around this level down here so if I move this line down to here this is where I'm looking for price to go to and then I'll look over to the left here and see what else we've got that might stop that we have this area here that uh, ties in with that level. Okay, so that's my target area around 79.50s. And then if I draw some Fibo tools in, let's have a look at the Fibonacci. See if we can get an indication of where price is likely to head to. Yeah, so just below that line, we've also got 50% Fibonacci retracement level. So it's going to be an area of uh, strong support there, no doubt about it. So that's what we're looking for. Let me zoom out to a weekly. See what else I can see here. Okay, this is this is when it comes quite comes quite useful to zoom out on the uh, charts. So. Let me change the colour of this line to blue. Uh, blue violet, I do. Um, and what you can see, guys, is not only do we have that 50% retracement level there, which is here, but if we look right back, we can see that was a major area of resistance. Okay. And that was back into uh, November 2010. So you can see the price definitely respected that quite significantly in the past. And again here, we see a bounce of that level there as well. Another one there. So that area looks key. 79.50 level on New Zealand dollar. So that all ties in quite nicely, guys, with this, this sell trade. So that's what I'm going to be looking for to try and do is take price down to that level. Well, we haven't had the confirmation that this is going to go yet. So let me just get rid of half this mess on here, clean up these charts, and go back down to the daily. And basically, what I'm seeing is if this red candle, if we take the low of that red candle out, so if we get a Price coming down here somewhere. We've got a confirmed sale, and we can look for maybe a potential retracement and then sell it. So that's what I'll be looking for on New Zealand dollar. Lovely looking trade, guys. Um, I've been waiting for this for days and days, weeks, in fact, and now I think we've seen it. Now, another reason why price held there was because of this again. Fibonacci is very, very powerful, as I keep talking about in the past. What do we see? 61.8% retracement level. Notice how price hit the 61.8% Fibonacci level and has since rejected that level and come down. So that's another reason why price has stalled there. So price is king and we're waiting for price to tell us that it wants to go down and at this moment in time it looks highly probable New Zealand is going to drop. New Zealand against a dollar. So there's your analysis guys. So we're looking for hopefully, like I said I haven't confirmed this yet, but it looks highly probable at the moment that uh, New Zealand dollar is going to try and make its way down to 79.50.
from its current level. So, if again, as I often do in my uh, analysis, we, we're gonna have to with these types of trades, guys. You'll have to keep your stop loss significantly out of the way up here somewhere. So let me see what I can see uh, over the next few days. If we can get a good trade and I can do a video, I'll put one together for you, an update video. But for now, here's the analysis, here's the trade setup. Keep your eye on that New Zealand dollar for some easy money. Okay, thanks guys, we'll see you soon. Bye bye.